In the last class, you studied the main geometric relationships that can be applied to designs to understand their importance. As we have learned, it is not enough to just define geometric relationships. It is necessary to also use dimensions in order to conclude the geometry. In this class, you will learn about dimensional relationships and their purpose applied to a design. You will also study about the changes implemented in this new version for your design parameterization. Dimensional relationships are additional dimensions added to entities, elements or objects which compose the design. Their purpose is to define measurements or numerical values applied to an entity based on a system of user-defined measurement units. The dimensional value can be changed at any time and then the entity will be automatically updated based on the new input value. These changes make parameterization possible to assign expressions to dimensions and to apply mathematical operators and also relay them to other dimensions. Thereby, dimensional value editing has been applied and referenced in the expression for another dimension and this updates it. Take a look at this. And this applies a set of geometric relationships. For example, if you change the numerical value on one entity which is defined as equal, then all others will be updated automatically. Take a look at this. AutoCAD provides specific tools for measuring several elements that make up the design. For example, you can use linear, horizontal, vertical and aligned for measuring linear entities. There's an angular tool for angles and diameters and radial for diameters. Whenever you use these tools, you must evaluate the design intent so that dimensions can be inserted correctly. Thereby you are able to get enhanced design parameterization, making editing faster and easier. So in this class you have learned about using dimensional relationships and the importance of using them jointly with geometric relationships. These two elements are used to maintain design intent and reduce wasted time on design modifications. And this is possible thanks to implemented parameterization in AutoCAD 2010.